listen, listen. It, it, it looks like I'm, it looks like I'm like dragging this out, but like you know, I have to do something until 6.2 hits, and if it's gonna be late August, well, I don't really mind. Um, so second boss, um, it summons poison gases things. The skill's called Fall of Man. Um, it summons on the targeted player. I think it's, um, I'm not sure if it's indicated or not. I'm not sure, but um, it summons that, then it gains a damage buff. Depending on um, depending on how many there are, and then there's going to be a mustard gas that noms the uh, the gas clouds, and you have to like let it norm the gas clouds um, to like reduce the damage buff. Like, that doesn't really matter at this point because everything just like dies so easily. And we're approaching the third and final boss, which is Nidhogg. These pillars um, provide like cool separation things so each of these like individual pulls aren't um aren't too overwhelming um this part that's coming up is pretty fun where you have like wyverns coming out of these uh are they egg sacs i don't know if they're egg sacs or anything but we kind of go back to the pup purply aura i guess because we're outside i guess you can call that consistency <laughs> a little bit um and then after you get through those, come up the stairs, and this is where like the final battle against Nid well not fine, well the the boss fight against Nidhogg takes place. Um, at some point he's gonna fly up, and Asinian's gonna try and like shield against his um, giant nuke. Uh, and then mobs are gonna spawn. There's like one that spawns like here, like three things that spawn here, and then so like two off to the sides. Um, that's like the first and second wave. And then there's one dragon that spawns like here, like where the chest usually is. Like the chest is like somewhere around here. The third dragon is like also somewhere around here. And the fourth dragon touches down like really close to Estinian here. Um, Estinian looks like he's gonna die, but like with like enough DPS and you know, you know if things die actually like really quickly, you don't actually need to heal him at all. So that's 